Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. Today I'm planting up this large container with elephant ears and a couple other plants. And I just wanted to share this with you guys. I wanted to share the complete elephant ear um, from bulb to clean up at the end of the season. So I just want you guys to see how I use these in my garden and you know how they grow during the season so i'm using this tis organic worm castings and i actually really really like it um there is a link in the description if you want to buy some um, it is an affiliate link so just know that you won't pay anything extra and i'll get a little bit of something to fuel my plant addiction at no extra cost to you And make sure you guys stay to the end because I do have a two week update on this pot and then the other plants that I'm going to be planting and showing you later on in this video. So here's the two week update on the canna lily. It looks fabulous, it looks full. The bed itself just looks full. I also planted an elephant ear that same um, day. So it looks great too. And here is the elephant ear pot with the colas. Don't mind my drip tubing in the back. So the colas look amazing. They're actually getting really full. They started to flower, so I ended up pitching off the flower buds so that the plant could focus more energy on to foliage growth. And I don't think I ever got the chance to see Dusty Miller flower. I think I think I saw their flower like online somewhere, but and and it was yellow. So I would love to see those flower this year too. I'm so happy with this pot. This is not its final resting place. I am going to move it to another location so it's out of the way, especially as it gets bigger. You kind of want them to have their own space. Gorgeous. And colas are so easy to grow from seed. If you want to grow your own, I will link my seed starting video in the corner. But other than that, happy gardening, guys. See you in the next video. Bye.